Hi everyone and a welcome to my channel. So today I have for you a dirt cheap haul. <laughs> I forgot where I went. Uh, it was dirt cheap. So found some pretty cool items. Uh, spent $48.38. I had a punch card that was worth um, 10% off. So um, I'm going to show you what I got. I didn't add up the original prices, um, because some of the items, I didn't know what the original prices were. So I'm just going to say the, all that I spent, everything I'm going to show you was $48. Um, I picked up this beauty. This is a cooling, super cooling comfort down alternate performance pillow. This is a really cool, it still even has its, um, Kohl's tag on it. It was originally $59.99 at Kohl's. It was at Dirt Cheap for, can't see, $39.99. And I paid $21 and... 59 cents for it. So I'm super excited for this for whatever reason. And it hasn't always been like this, but when I sleep, my head sweats and I don't know why that is, but I'm hoping this will help. Um, it's cool. Coolness of ice fabric. Feel the instant. So we're going to give that a try. And I was excited to find it for $21. Next is a sign that I picked up to share with my sister. It's not, yeah, it's a sign. It's a metal sign. It says, support your local butcher, butcher, baker, barbecue maker. This was 90% off. Um, it was $14.99. And because of my a punch card, I got it for $1.35. So this item, Dirt Cheap has a... Uh, scanning an app um, it's it's dirt cheap and it has I, think, I believe a rooster on it the app does the app picture is a rooster I believe or chicken whatever um, and you can actually scan the items there in the store which will help you and know how much it costs obviously um, this did not scan so if you find an item that doesn't scan you can always take it to the front when you check out and I asked them how much it is, and you can decide then um, what, if you want it or not. So this was 90% off. I had previously purchased myself one, so I was almost positive if they were going to sell it to me, it was going to be 90% off because I already have one of these in my kitchen. Um, but yeah, if you get a chance to go to Turk Cheap, make sure you download that app. It will help you immensely because sometimes things get put in the wrong spot. Sometimes things don't get marked down as low as they're supposed to, or the tag doesn't get the sheet that says the percent off for that number. Each dirt cheap item has a number code on it, and there'll be sheets in that section that tells you how much it is and how much the price is. So 90% off got that. Uh, picked up this Rust-Oleum clear chalkboard paint. Um, I thought this was kind of cool. It's clear. So you can, any color, um, paint can now become chalkboard. I had not ever seen that before. I got it for $2.69. So a good little buy right there for the craft room. I love this chapstick, um, total hydration, um, chapstick. Um, they had it, it was $3.99 and I picked it up for $2.15. So a good price point. This is the only kind that I can use without causing my lips to literally chap and crack and all the bad things. So, um, this does have essential oil in it, uh, lavender and chamomile. So I may just use this at night. I don't, I don't know. Usually I just use the plain one this i have these everywhere and i use them but i thought i would give these a try because they were you know on clearance so i got those next are a pair a couple of old navy items um 
They do sell name brand clothes. We get Justice clothes there for my granddaughter. We get her Old Navy. I believe we've picked up some Gap things there. They have just all sorts of things. You never know what you will find at Dirt Cheap. This week, they had some winter clothes, um, Old Navy Active, and I picked up this like pullover little active wear um, shirt jacket thingy is with the little zipper. Awesome. This was with my uh, punch card, $7.20. Got that. And I don't know how much that was originally. Next are some um, leggings. These are really nice too. Um, these were $9. And they are also Old Navy Active. So, I was glad to add these to the collection. They're really nice. I got those. And then last but not least is this Magpie Tom Frost, Tom Frost Wildlife set of four extra large placemats. So how cool are those? Aren't those fun? I love them. This would be great for the fall. I love the colors of them. I love the critters. Actually, I may put these for winter time after Christmas is put up and we finish out the rest of winter. I may use these in my kitchen. I think that's what I'll do. I had thought I would put them for fall, but I think I'm going to wait. Let's open them. Let's let's just take a look see. Um designed in Britain, made in China. So they're actually in this really nice box. They had some that were already open, so I did get to see them. Um, here's the box without the glare. The lid. Oh yeah, these are really nice. Let's see if I can get them out. They are cork backed lacquer coated board placemats. White clean with a damp cloth. So, sorry about that. That one. I like that. They're like cork. Here's this one. And last but not least is the fox. What does the fox say? <laughs> anyway, so that is it. I really like these and I thought they were really pretty. And to pick them up for $2, how much did I say? They were $24.99. They would have been $2.50 because they were 90% off, but I had the, the little coupon of um, the little punch card so they were two dollars 25 cents so i was excited for that anyway guys that is it that is my haul that is everything that i found at dirt cheap i used to go to dirt cheap and find all the deals here lately i have not been finding too many deals um my daughter did find some clothing deals for her and the granddaughter um, but I didn't find too many deals. So, like I said, I paid $48.38 and that pillow was 20 of it. And then there are other few little things that I got into the pillow and the two clothes and then a few things. So anyway, guys, that is it. That is my haul. I hope you are having an amazing day. If you have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, become part of my friends here on YouTube, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys.